The Euro 2016 England team has been announced, but let's take some time to introduce you to the wildest squad around. In goal, we have Killer Croc, the biggest man on the pitch and will snap anything out of the air. Here's the lowdown on Gotham City's beastly resident. Here are our fullbacks, starting with El Diablo. Everyone loves a fiery right back to fire some crosses. He's got exceptional skill with pyrokinesis, but needs to keep that anger in check. Up next is Slipknot. This left back is bound to tie the opponent's winger in knots. Let's have a deeper dive into the Ropemaster's vital stats. The centre halves, Colonel Rick Flagg, Vice Captain, strong, regimented and commands respect from his squad. Is there nothing this soldier can't do? Yes, it's Captain Boomerang. Every team has a centre half who loves to bend the rules. The Aussie Roughneck brings an air of ruthlessness to the team, but can he be trusted? Introducing Amanda Waller, the skipper and midfield general. She sees all the angles and pulls the strings away from the danger zones. Uh oh, here comes trouble. One half of our unorthodox centre midfield duo, the Joker. Not too much information on this guy, but he's guaranteed to get the last laugh. Just ask Batman. The Joker's partner in crime on and off the pitch. Here's Harley Quinn. So much to discuss about the former psychiatrist, Dr. Harleen Quinzel, Bell Reeves' most popular inmate. Our wingers, Katana, small and slight. She plays with a lot of soul and will slice through defenses. A lethal weapon trained samurai, Tatsu Yamashiro, is more than meets the eye. Enchantress. Her samba skills will enchant defenses. Mystery surrounds June Moon and her alter ego Enchantress. She's definitely one to keep an eye on. Finally, the centre forward, Deadshot. This man has killer instincts and deadly accuracy from any shooting position. Floyd Lawton does not accept anything but perfection and his rap sheet proves this. So there you have it, the complete lineup for the Suicide Squad. A lot of talent and skill with a lot of past mistakes to make up for. Can they do it? Find out in cinemas on August 5th.